want to thank you because you're a good God. And we want to thank you because you have given us ways in which to get to know you better, ways which in which to follow you, ways in which to get your blessings. And Lord, today as we are here, we just want to learn more about you, get to know you more in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 So, mm-hmm. when Jesus was here, he taught a lot. And last week we learned about... Can you remember? I don't know. I can remember. The calling of the disciples. The calling of the disciples. The calling yes. of the disciples. Yes. And we saw that the disciples had to stop what they were doing mm. to be able to follow, follow Jesus. Jesus yeah. And we gave you a challenge this week. Do you mm. remember? What I was actually the challenge? remember. Mm-hmm. You, I think the challenge was what some of the things that we can drop in order to follow Jesus. Yes. Yes. And there was a lot of things that we mentioned, some examples. Mm-hmm. Now, following Jesus is not just about stopping stuff. Yeah. It's also about learning to do stuff. Mm, interesting. Um, yeah, that's deep. That's really, really you deep. You know? Yeah. And I, God teaches us to, to not just abandon things, but also gives us what to replace. Remember what we said? Mm-hmm. When you're dropping bad habits, you're also replacing them with good habits. Good habits. Yeah. And being followers of Christ mm-hmm. means then we are trying to follow what Christ is doing. Mm-hmm. Really, that's what a follower. Yeah. You know, yeah, if you follow yeah. me on Instagram. <laughs> okay, I'm not on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when you follow people, you're trying to be more more like, like them, them or you yeah. like the content that they're they giving you mm-hmm. and so jesus gave us guidelines mm-hmm. and he kept talking you know for the whole time he was here he kept teaching and saying if you do this then this will happen if you do this mm-hmm. and if you have given of yourself to follow jesus then mm-hmm. some of those things should be able to come naturally you yeah, know yeah. like if you're a student mm-hmm. you know that you should wear a uniform yeah you know that you should you should be in class when it's time for class exactly yeah. Zoom class? <laughs> no, <laughs> doesn't count. Zoom, you can turn off your camera. <laughs> <laughs> you can turn off your camera and not forget you go. No, <laughs> we'll stay in class. We'll stay in class. Even if it's virtual. <laughs> so, you know, when you know you're a student, you mm. don't wake up one day and think, you know, Naskia Kuba, Leo's red. Oh, yeah, true. If Kericho Primary wears blue, you have to wear blue, blue. because you are a You're student of, of Kericho yeah, Primary, exactly, you know. Yeah. And so last week, we gave you a chance to become, to get saved, to get to know God. And some of you are already saved. Mm. And when we get saved, God expects that we not only listen, mm-hmm. but that we also go ahead and do some mm-hmm. of the things that Christ asks us. Mm-hmm. And so when I think about the Beatitudes, mm-hmm. um, the story that is found um, in Matthew, mm-hmm. that, that God is not just asking us to just follow him like just listen Mm. he's also asking us if you're really following me Mm. so you do some of the stuff that i'm asking Um, you then Mm. i'm asking of you Mm. you know Mm. um and and i think what's also profound is jesus doesn't ask us to do things that he himself cannot do ah yes you know like when he tells us to be compassionate to other people Mm -hmm. he's he's actually compassionate Mm -hmm. you know uh when he tells us to to be pure in heart Mm -hmm. uh he was pure in heart you know he was a man with no sin at all at all at all so he things that are possible things that are possible yeah yeah and it's nice to know some of the things that christ is asking of us Mm. it doesn't cost money it doesn't as true, in true. Then cost, it's not painful. Mm. It's not painful to be kind to somebody, mm. you know. Like part of some, some of the Beatitudes when Jesus says, you know, depend only on God, mm. you know. Mm. Be merciful to others. Mm. Be kind. Mm. Make peace with others. Yeah. Make, make peace with everyone. I know that's a hard one. Yeah, that's a hard one. <laughs> <laughs> But Jesus said it because he actually knew yeah. it was possible. Mm. And he had done it. He yeah. had made on the peace. cross, on the yeah. cross he said, Forgive them, for they do not know what they are doing. How Imagine. easy is it to forgive? It's not easy. Yeah. It's not easy. Kwanza in school. Yeah. Imagine ukona kuna wale watu walikuwa na kuibia kalamu alafu anatoa lecture na alikuwa anakuachia nje so imagine you, exam yes, iko 5 we minutes see you in cruelty yani, <laughs> alafu mtu anatoa pen yako una ah what happened <laughs> alafu after exam anakuja anakuambia she got a good idea you know and and Jesus is telling you make peace with everyone forgive forgive like, yeah ata umse yeah. yeah and I normally think no matter what we've done, mm. even us, because you know we look at forgiving like Nimina mm. You know God has to forgive you every day, even you. Yeah, true. For the things that you say, true. for the things that you do, God mm. has to keep forgiving us. Mm. I don't know why we find it so hard to forgive. You know, like God forgives. I think it's because we are human beings. You know. Yeah. It's easy for for us to keep grudges. Yeah. Yeah. Be merciful. How easy is it for you to be kind to other people? It's easy. Mm-hmm. When when easy? you like these people, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, but when you don't like them, it's not easy. It's not easy. Yeah, because even in school, I remember mm-hmm. in school, kuna wale watu people don't like them. Yeah, you know, so you can't be kind to such people. 
because yeah. people, everyone doesn't like them. But imagine Jesus tells us to be kind to everyone. And he everyone. knows it's possible. Yeah. And it, he knows it's very you know, possible. Yeah. He says for us to comfort and to mourn with those who mourn. Mm. Um, and we've had people around us sometimes who mourn, whether it's a loss of a loved one, mm. whether it's a loss of, you know, we've had people go through tough times. Mm. And God is saying, if you comfort them, even mm. I will comfort you, you, yeah. you know. Mm. Um, God says to love your enemies oh. and pray for them. <laughs> okay, loving them, you can love them, but praying for them. Ah, yes, right. No, okay, it's, it's, it's <laughs> hard. It's hard. <laughs> Imagine praying for your enemy. Yeah. Well, you're praying for your family. Oh, God bless my family. And I'm not, I cannot forget my, my enemies, Lord. Bless them, bless them so that they can hate me more. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you it's, know, it's, no. it's, it's, not, it's not easy. It's to, not easy. Yeah. But I think Jesus asks us these things again and again, we keep saying, because he knows mm. it's possible. You know, Jesus says, you know, Jesus even taught us how to pray. Mm. You know, Jesus taught us the Lord's Prayer. Mm. Uh, Jesus taught us in the same, when we read the same Sermon on the Mount, he mm. goes on to teach us that we should not worry. Mm. How easy is it not to worry? It's or how hard easy. is it? It's not easy. It's not, is it? Yeah. Especially with Corona. Yeah, yeah true, true, true. <laughs> 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 you cough in the supermarket. <laughs> My desk mate, please take, take all my textbooks. <laughs> <laughs> Don't take the green one. <laughs> you know, and we are we are worried. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know you guys at home, sometimes you have to go out and meet people, and sometimes you worry. Mm -hmm. Like when Corona gets somebody that you know, it suddenly it, it, it's scary. Yeah, you know, when is. something, when your neighbors get robbed, yeah. it's scary for you to think, wow, what if they come to our home? And mm -hmm. we hear scary stories all the time. Yeah. But Jesus says, don't be anxious, you know, don't don't let it make you not sleep because mm -hmm. you're worried about something. Mm -hmm. um, some of you, your parents are home right now and they don't they don't have work. Yeah. They don't have income. Mm -hmm. And it's only natural to think to, to begin to worry where will food come from, True. you know. And God says, don't be anxious, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. um, and Jesus goes on to teach us the importance of obeying his word. He mm. says, anyone who hears mm. and obeys his teachings of mine is like a wise person mm. who built a house on a solid rock. And you know mm. the story, the two guys yeah. who built their houses, one built on a rock, rock. the other one built on sand. sand. Yeah. Um, and the one that built on a rock, of course, when the storms came, the house stood. stood yeah. And the one that built on sand, when the storms came, it was shaken. You know, it was mm. shaken, it fell. Mm. Um, and that's the same thing with our faith as we get to know God, mm. that we reach a place where we're also building. You think of it like a building. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, for your own faith mm. to be strong. Yeah. And Jesus says, don't just listen. Mm. Do what I'm asking what I'm you. Asking. Yeah. You know. Mm. Um, if your parent has ever sent you, let us see you. Let us see you. And sometimes you're distracted. You're watching Let us see so the third time we are going to do it, we are going to object. What did I do? I'm going to see more. Oh, so you are going to be a sim to answer my anger pole pole and I will be a And there's a, you know, that's when you know there's a difference between kuskia mm. and following what and you following, have been, yeah. what you've True. been told. True. And Jesus just wants us to be able to obey the things that he's asked of us to do. And like we said, mm. they're simple. Mm. But here's a beautiful thing, Hezron, because mm -hmm. I want you to also comment on this. Mm -hmm. God says he will bless us when you do those things. He yeah. says if you comfort those who are mourning, he'll mm. also comfort you. Mm. You know. He says if you're pure in heart, if you do this, then he'll do this. And God is attaching, like we began, mm. promises. Mm. You guy. You know, sometimes you sit down and you're like, how do I pass this exam? Mm. Una soma, because somebody has given you a formula. Mm. Una, you go and cram. Mm. God is saying, if you want my blessings, mm. this is how to get my blessings. Mm. You guys don't think it's nice just to know how to get God's blessings, Yanni? It is, it is. Personally. It is. Yeah, it is. And I think when, when, when God gives us these blessings, mm -hmm. uh, what stands out for me is, I think there's a part that says, is it blessed that are the pure in heart for they will see God? Yeah. Uh, when, when I think about that and, mm -hmm. and the thought of me seeing God face yeah. to face, you know, yeah. Uh, no, even even when when I'm still on earth, yeah. I will see God in so many ways. Yeah. Like ni ta ni ta God. But about the na Peter na mimi. Eh we ni God. You know. Uh, yeah. Nili Peter mtiani. That's God. Yeah. But then there is actually seeing God. You yeah. will see God, and yeah. that's the beauty of everything. That's the beauty of, of of life and the beauty of following Christ. Yeah. That at the end of the day, you know, I will see God. Yeah. You know, uh, and I like saying this. This is my favorite statement, by the way. Mm -hmm. I think when everyone talks about heaven and 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 they talk about honey and milk and all these things, uh, Mimi, 
I will see God, you know. The beauty yeah. is seeing God. <laughs> you don't want milk and honey? I do, <laughs> but now the beauty of heaven is actually seeing God. Yeah. So when, when God says, when God gives us all these blessings, some of them will come when we're here on earth, yeah. but some of them will, will come when we go to heaven. Yeah. You know? When we see God, when, when, the, when everything fades away, when our pain is no more, when mm -hmm. everything else goes away, you mm -hmm. know. Mm. And so our challenge to us this week, as you read the word of God, as you learn the word of God, mm -hmm is to not just hear, but to also do. And to be able to note that this week I have learned to do A, and mm. I'm actually going to do A. Last week mm. we asked you to accept Jesus into your life, and you did. Mm. Um, and this week we're asking you to be kind. We're asking you to follow mm. the teachings that Jesus has put in his mm. Bible for you. Mm -hmm. um, and as you do this, God says he will bless you. He'll bless you. And yeah. you can read. So you tell yourself as you read the Beatitudes, mm. if I am kind to other people, God will do this for me. Mm. If I do this for other people, if I make peace, mm. you know, God will do this for mm. me. Mm. And isn't it nice to know you don't have to go through anybody, you don't need favors to do yeah. from who God says, you know, just open this door mm. and I'll do this for you. Mm. And that's our challenge this week. Mm. That you will learn the promises of God. Mm. Amen. Amen. Yeah. So we pray. Yep. Ah, great. Oh, uh, the memory verse. I oh, memory forgot. verse, yeah. <laughs> this week it's long. <laughs> It is Matthew chapter 6, verse 9 to 13. But at your age, you guys, I know you got this. You should pray like this. Our Father who is in heaven, help us to honor your name. Come and set up your kingdom so that everyone on earth will obey you as you are obeyed in heaven. Mm. Give us our food for today. Forgive us for doing wrong as we forgive others. Keep us from being tempted and protect us from evil. Mm. And you pray, yeah. our Father. Mm. Our Father. At Imsha Memorize. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah. Is going to pray for us, then we call it a day. Right, let's pray. Lord, we thank you for today's lesson. We thank you for what you have taught us through your word. And you say in your word in Isaiah 59 that your ear is not too dull to hear and your hand is not too short to save. So Lord, when we pray to you, uh, you will come down and you will answer us, Lord. And Lord, you have given us all these guidelines and every guideline comes with a promise, Lord. So I pray that would you help us to, to follow these guidelines so that when, when the time comes, when we, we will see you, we will rejoice and be glad in you, Lord. I thank you and I bless you. Keep us safe until next week in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you next week. Same, same time, place. same Sa place. <laughs> Different, <laughs> Different <clothes>. hopefully. <laughs> see you guys. Bye-bye.